hey guys i know it's been hella long i feel like i said this before in a couple videos back saying like it's been a minute blah, blah 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 i know i get it i'm with you but i'm back um i'm better than ever of course um it's been a long time um i think it's been three months i believe since i've uploaded um the reason being is because over the summer i was working at a very interesting job that required me to do overnights so um it just gives me ptsd thinking about it because mentally physically i was drained to the max like i never experienced something so bad and so intense in my life until i started working overnights i was working overnights hella busy hella hectic and but yeah i just didn't have the time to actually sit down and record even though i really really wanted to but um because i was so mentally drained i didn't know what to record for you guys because the last thing that i did film was ken's kenneth's birthday party and when we went to six flags i still have it in my files i still have it edited it's just me wanting to or it's just me thinking whether i should upload it or not even though kenneth has been begging me to upload it because it's kind of like a vlog of his birthday slash another vlog when he went to six flags so i'm still thinking of uploading it or not uh just because it's like hella long ago his birthday was in june 6th i think that's what i mentioned in my very last video so yeah anyway enough of that i don't work there anymore i i don't want to say quit because i didn't necessarily quit but i also don't want to say i got like i okay i quit slash was laid off from the job um because in the beginning it was more of a temporary job because i thought not that i thought but i mentioned that i was gonna go back to school um so it was already planned out for me to leave like the very last couple of days of august but then there's a couple of things in my personal life that i'm still not ready to publicly say yet but um i was thinking of staying there longer past august the very last couple of days before i left that job it was really really bad for me so i was like no i can't do this anymore maybe it is a sign it was a sign for me to say you know what last week of august i'm out of here um so yeah i don't work there anymore thank god i mean the pay it was really really good but like the actual like work and the people in there were no i work in a different spot now um which i lowkey plan on doing like a work vlog maybe we'll see i still need to figure out <laughs> what's it like in there but i mean i'm very happy where i'm working at i'm working with the best employees ever like they're so nice and so cool so down to earth like i'm very very blessed to be working in an environment where i'm comfortable in um and because of that i have more time to dedicate to youtube and instagram because i've been like lacking on posting but i'm back and i'm better i do plan on doing like an updated q a video very very soon so stay on the lookout for that i'll be posting something about it on my instagram story so y'all should follow me keep me keep yourself updated on me there Does that make sense i don't know but yeah enough of me rambling for today's video, I'm gonna do another haul. <laughs> it's so heavy. Um, it's a big, big Fashion Nova haul. I decided to do another haul because one, my birthday is coming up, y'all. Today is the 8th. <laughs> I thought it was the 9th for a minute. So we're one, two, three, four, five days away from my birthday. My birthday is on the 13th. So. I decided to treat myself to some cute little pieces for my birthday and also little cute pieces that I needed for work. <laughs> I haven't done, I've done hauls before and I've seen that you guys really, really enjoy that. So I decided to do another haul, but this time with Fashion Nova. So let me tell you, Fashion Nova, I love y'all. 
please, please, please improve your packaging because <sighs> let me tell y'all, it was a struggle for these two packages to get here. The first one, according to my mom, she said it came ripped. Um, so as you can see that. I mean, I did have to pull out two tops because I needed them for work, which I'll show you guys later. But um, yeah, she said it came ripped. And then the other one, um, it came, it like dragged to arrive. It like literally took a week past its delivery date to get here. Um, turns out, according to a note that they have here, is that it, the package also got ruined. So don't know if it's because of the packaging, like it's, it comes in a bag, um, or maybe the people are delivering it all weird and stuff, but y'all need a improve the packaging you know what i mean but yeah let's get started with the haul everything that i mentioned i'm gonna put it down below in the description box so you guys can look it up hopefully if you guys are interested in these products or if you guys are interested in purchasing these items hopefully they're online because fashion nova tends to like sell out quickly um so but yeah i'm gonna put everything on the description box and hope you guys enjoy this little fashion nova haul Honestly, Fashion Nova should sponsor me by now because I've been purchasing their clothes back in like 2016, 2017. And like, Miss Fashion Nova, me and you gotta, we gotta talk. We're gonna do business here. <laughs> I'm playing. But let's just get right into it. Oh my God, that was so funny. <laughs> okay, so this first item. It's called the Kelsey Cowell Neck Mini Dress. So this is one of the pieces. So while I was on their website, not only was I looking for pieces for like everyday slash for work, um, I was also looking for pieces for my birthday. And so I was like, let me get this red dress because I need shit to have a red dress. So I was like, let's buy a red dress. So I'm just throw everything over here. So it looks like this. It has like little strap around the neck. And then it has this on the skirt. It has little bling on it. You know. Some fancy. Cute. I like it. Um, Material wise. It is kind of thin. Not going to lie. But it's really really pretty for like a night out. I got this in a size um, medium. But not gonna lie, I've been getting a little bit of worried, so I'm kind of nervous. Hopefully, it's not too like hoochie looking on the bottom. But I mean, come on now. <laughs> Next piece, I actually plan on wearing this on my actual birthday, which is on Monday. Um, by that I mean like posting pictures on my gram for my birthday, and I like really going out because my birthday falls on a Monday. So like, who really does something on a Monday? You know what I mean? This is called glove sequin mini dresses or mini dress okay miss thing cute so this is what it so this is what it looks like with the little v cut in the front sequins oh, so pretty shines in the light very nice very nice very elegant looking Cute, 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 cute. This is what skirt looks like. I am noticing though that the um, it keeps uh, what's it called getting stuck on the little sequins. But hopefully, it's not a hassle when I actually wear it. But it's really, really cute. Next, um, this is a top, it's called Tie to Your Lies Crop Top. Um, just so I don't repeat myself, all of my pieces except for the jeans, um, which we'll get to in, in a minute. All of my tops and dresses um, are medium sizes. I am 5'3 and I weigh 135. Hopefully, I still weigh 135. Because like I said, I've been getting a little bit of weight. Um, but yeah, okay. Oh, okay, okay. I'm like, what is this white thing? But I guess they're shoulder pads. Hmm. Um, we'll see how I like it. I'm going to try it on and i'll let you guys know how i like it with the shoulder pads i mean you could take it off i like how they don't like stitch it all the way through in case you probably don't like it so we'll see because honey this ain't the 80s <laughs> oh brother this guy stinks 
but um yeah cute little top um it's like the um you know shiny tops that you just wrap it around in the front like you just tie it in the front yeah um it has like little um flares going on the wrists very cute very fall vibes because you know the beige color and stuff so cute cute cute, cute. so this next top is called must be true sweater crop top um i did purchase two other white tops which i'm gonna insert right here i had to wear them before doing this haul for work so um but this is what these two tops look like i enjoyed it really much except for the bodysuit um it's kind of see-through and it was kind of tight in the bottom area because it's a body i literally set the shit out of this bag but um the bodysuit was in mm, okay for me um it's not like i thought it wasn't going to be see-through because that's not what it looked like in the picture um but it is really really see-through and the bottom area was kind of uncomfortable for me i might have to kind of like bear with it because i feel like if i were to get if i were to size up um it would look too weird in the top area because it is a zip up the other white top i actually love that top because it's not only is it basic but it's cut on the sides and it's like long in the front and the back so you know it look cute with leggings or jeans and you know covers both areas you know a little cape moment <laughs> this one is another white top that i bought for both going out and work because yes we have a dress code at work and we have to wear a white top this is what it looks like very cute very cute <laughs> um it has little gold buttons in the front in case you want to button up but honestly i probably wouldn't because probably like one or two um but yeah very cute i like how it's very it feels very thick so i know i won't be cold in these upcoming winter and fall days next this is another dress um this is tainted love velvet mini dress um i don't like i don't remember buying this but let's see what it looks like oh yeah and i remember <laughs> loki i was thinking of wearing this for like october because it gives me very like halloween vibes i'm gonna find like some sort of like halloween character that i could wear this with um because it has like this on the sides and it's very like very sexy vibes you know what i mean because <laughs> it's velvet and it's black and it's a mini dress i'm kind of nervous about this though in the front because i don't have big you know, so I'm kind of nervous about that. But I mean, if anything, I could use the fashion tapes that they sell, like, in drugstores and stuff. So, but, yeah. We'll see how that works. If not, again, I could probably wear this for, like, as a costume for something. I don't know. But I really, really liked how it looked online. So, I was like, why not? So, if you know me, you know I love graphic tees. I live for graphic tees. Like, ever since I was little, my mom would always, like be irked by how much i love graphic tees because she she was like kind of old school back in the day um so literally i would buy hella angry birds graphic tees um one direction tees um it was like a bunch of graphic tees and so i still live for graphic tees to this day and um i got me some simpsons graphic tees um i think this is from the men's like section though in fashion nova um this is a oh no this is from the women's section uh, this is team simpsons oversized crew fleece and i got me a medium and the simpsons is one of my favorite tv shows um but i have two other ones that i still haven't worn yet because i haven't had like a good day to wear them slash good shoes to wear them with so shoe plugs if y'all seeing this right now Hit me up, don't call me, but hit me up. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Cute. I love it. It has all them here on the top. I mean, in the front. Oh, very, very cute. Team Simpson. And then I like how it has um, 89 stitched. And it has their um, logo here on the sides too. And most importantly, I like that it's black because perfect for fall. And it matches with everything, so 
cute another graphic tee this is from the men's section fashion over men you can see, see right there i got this in a size small because it looked it looked like those type of material that is like very stretchy already so i didn't want to like um go overboard with the sizing huh i should have gotten a medium but anyway not gonna lie i kind of regret not getting a medium now now that i'm looking at it in person but i mean i still like it you know i have a bar toe also halloween vibes catch me wearing this in october because you know come on now okay next i got um a jumpsuit and it's called soothe off shoulder jumpsuit what i'm liking so far is that i don't know if you guys can see like a little like curve on it so that means it's, it's very adjustable to like your body curves and stuff like that which i love and it doesn't feel so like thin it feels pretty thick so i'm excited about that but um this i'm going to a concert in november so i was planning on wearing this that day um and just like over accessorize with like jewelry and stuff so yeah but maybe i'll try it on just to see but yeah pretty cute where do i open it from boy where is the I'm gonna dig my finger in it. Okay. Yeah, so this I got in a size medium. Perfect. I like it. It's Chicago State of Mind. Because you know how they have Empire State of Mind? But it's just a Chicago with like the Chicago graffiti type print. Pretty cool. I like it. last but not least of this first package cassie sent in mini dress um this i also was planning on wearing on my actual birthday as well but we'll see what happens because i'm still debating what to wear still because i don't have heels yet and i don't know what i'm doing yet but i just bought it just so i could be right you know what i mean but this looks so gorgeous on the website y'all like so this is what it looks like. It is a one sleeve type dress. Satin. A button on the wrist. And this is what the skirt looks like. Very, very fancy looking. And I like how it has like the little adjustable on the sides because again, I was a little nervous that maybe because it, since it's satin, it's not quite as comforting as like the normal like just that i just showed you guys because it's more stretchier than this one so i'm like okay i like how it has this on the sides in case i'm not comfortable with how it feels i can adjust it to how loose or how tight i want it so love 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 it cute very very cute um again size medium so that is it for the first package now for the second package um they had like a, for their jeans, they had a buy one, get one free deal. So I definitely took advantage of that because one, I need new jeans. Two, why not, you know? So actually, let me show you guys the two jeans from the first package first, right? So this one is called Curve Your Waist Skinny Jeans. Um, I am in size 5 in their jeans. Which is a size 27 in like regular, like another type of sizing term. But yeah, I'm normally in size 5. You know, just basic blue skinny jeans. Very, very stretchy, which I love. I love jegging type jeans, you know what I mean? And high-waisted. I go for high-waisted jeans all the time because I got used to wearing high-waisted growing up. So and now this one is called called first pick high rise jeans again this is more of a darker blue compared to the other one again very stretchy i love that next pair of jeans bruh so you know how i told you that they damaged my package freaking stained it 
it looks like they ran like a wheel on it too <sighs> ew my double chin came out oh my god <laughs> oh ho, brother ho whoa 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 now so, oh my god, I'm so disappointed. I mean, I could clean it, you know, but like, I'm supposed to be satisfied, bruh. So, anyway, uh, this is a size, I mean, pff, size. This is our favorite high rise skinny jeans. Bruh, I mean, Luckily, it's not too bad. Like, it's not too hard of a freaking stain and all that. So, I could clean it, obviously. Like, I could buy, like, those little, like, cleaning sticks. I'm just being dramatic, you know what I mean? But, yeah. Ooh, I like this. On this size. Cute, 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 cute. Um, it's also ripped. It has, like, little rips on the thin knees. Light wash, blue jeans. Next pair of jeans. This is called Emma Super Stretch. Super Stretch. High rise skinny jean and medium blue wash. Let's open her up. Super stretchy. Again, love how it has a little curve. Very cute. Basic with more of a lighter wash in the front. This next pair of jeans is Classic Beauty Skinny Jeans. This actually looks like the jeans that I have. It's called the Classic Skinny Jeans, something like that. Um, this feels more of a jegging. This one and the first one that I showed you guys felt more like a jegging, so. Extra comfiness for your booty, if you know what I mean, eh? <laughs> it's so hot. Uh, I'm dying. I'm dying. Okay. This is the Don't Break My Heart Flare Jean. I like flare pants, so I was like, let me try this flare jean. Hey guys, again, I look good in some flare jeans. So, I mean, some flare pants, so. Whoa. Okay. Very cute. Very stretchy as well. Oh my god. <gasps> I like this. Like I said, it gives me very 70s vibes. This is what it looks like. Not gonna lie, they look they do look a little big from the butt side. But I think we'll be fine. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. They do feel a little bit heavy as well, so hmm. We'll see how it looks like, but they look very, very cute. I'm very excited to try them out. Next we have Kiana Distress Flare Jeans. This one also looks interesting online. Again, a big flare pant. This it's like interesting because look, 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 look. So these are a lighter wash with rip designs, right? Ow! So, you know, very cute. Cute from the back as well. But look at the flare. <gasps> Extremely cute. Ripped. You see how cute that is? You know how fire is going to look like? Bro, I'm going to look. Y'all need these for real so we could look popping all together. You know what I mean? Very, very cute. Compared to the other flare jeans, these are less stretchier. So this would definitely fit better. And they're also less heavier. Okay, so just keep that in mind. But yes. Cute. They're double high rise skinny jeans. Okay. Cute. It has more of a softer blue medium wash jeans again very stretchier so look in the bag you know just basic skinny jeans these are their popular uh mom jeans on fashion over it's called i got it from my mama jeans um i got this in like i said size seven because the reviews were saying a size up right so hmm and they're also adjustable or not adjustable but like you could just or you could fold them how you want them at the end so but yeah i think we'll be fine we'll see when i try it on right now you guys will see okay now this is their boyfriend jeans right get it together destroyed boyfriend jeans i didn't know they were ripped from the back um But anyway, I legit did not know they were ripped from the back. <laughs> I'm dead. 
did okay but also i got a size five because they're ripped right so i'm like since they're ripped they're more um looser right so that's why i got a size five but yeah size five is a decent size to be honest but i didn't know they were ripped from the back shorty <laughs> yikes okay we'll see I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm like legit dead. But anyway, but they don't fit. I mean, I can give it to one of my friends. I know they like these type of jeans as well. So it's all good. Now, this is a stacked honey high rise pants. So I've also been on the hunt for some stacked pants um, last year, but then I couldn't find any. And then I didn't want to buy some for the summer because, you know, I feel like they're not. I mean, people could wear them in the summer, like, yeah, you guys could do whatever the hell you want. But for me, personally, I wouldn't wear them in the summer because they gave me more, like, fall, winter vibes. So, I was like, you know, fall is coming up, you know. So, I started to get myself some pants, the stack pant. This is this feels more like a legging, though, not like an actual pant. Hmm. And I got this in a size medium. Okay, yeah, that'll be fine. Since it's more of a legging material, medium would definitely work. You can see it's stacked. Obviously, when I wear it, you'll see the design of it more better, but yeah. Oh, I also like how... Oh yeah, they're like ripped from the... Not ripped, but they're, they have a slit on the side, which is pretty cool. Love that. Okay, so this is another... Um... Oh, so it's like a jogger, so yeah. Well, they call it pant, but it's like... It feels more like a jogger type material. So this is curves and chill color block stack. Half of it is gray, half of it is black. And I'm like, that's pretty dope, not gonna lie. And with the cute, like, probably a black top. And then some dope shoes. Fire. But yeah, it's scrunched up from the, almost on the top all the way to the bottom. And I got a size small because it is adjustable from the waist. And since it's scrunchier, I feel like, you know, you could literally, yeah, a small is definitely perfect because again, you could adjust it from the waist and you just, you know, and then, yeah, also with, with reviews as well, they said that they are, do run kind of big, so, and I agree, they do run kind of big, so I'm happy that a small, cute, last but not least another stack pant it's also like that one curves and chill curves and chill stack pant which is just a basic gray one but this one i got a medium cute scrunched up from the top all the way to the bottom love it i'm very excited to wear these for the fall and stuff Honestly, I've, I've got okay. So jeans, obviously, you can wear that all year round. But besides that, I feel like I got appropriate pieces for like my birthday and like for Halloween, October vibes, and fall to be honest. So pretty excited. Not gonna lie, it was a little pricey for both. Hmm. But I'm pretty happy. Not gonna lie.
Alright guys, so I literally had to come and sit down because I was tired. I was like dying and literally my waves already like started to freaking go down now. But yeah, that is it for today's haul slash video. I really do hope you guys enjoy it and I'm so happy to be back. I'm so happy to be on my grind. <sighs> Honestly, like this truly makes me happy. Like I enjoy doing this. It's just like things happen you know what i mean or i just like need like an extra push and extra motivation to actually do it so yeah i'm so happy to be back um i will start planning content like start planning videos and stuff like that but most likely my next video will be an updated q a so make sure to follow me guys on all my social medias because i'm going to be asking y'all for y'all to ask me questions <laughs> so yeah um Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you to my three subscribers. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Ciao.